Hi, my name is KTM Sales. So today I have a video for you guys on the AK47 conversion kit. Basically, you turn your Tip 98 into an AK, A5, X7 Classic, or, or any of those conversion kit into AK. So let's get started. This is the Tip 98 version right here that we made into an AK version. So you get your AK47 handguard kit, buttstock, and the pistol grip right there. So cool, kind of nice. Um, each one of these conversion kit needs a little bit of modification to install. You cannot just slap it on because the body and some variation there, you're gonna need to a little bit of a conversion um, application right there. So once you have it, on the 98 version, it's a little bit different. On the Blizzard version, a little different. Uh, on the Blizzard version, you have to file the inside a little bit right here to make the top rail able to slide the site over it. Not the one we have here, but um, made a cutout right here so you can see what's going on. But basically, if you see this little rail part over here, you have to file the section off a little bit, allow the whole site assembly to slide in here, which prevent it from any wiggling. So on the blizzard, that's what you have to do. All right, on the A5 version, um, some of the A5 version, the body right here, it's a little bit off. So you either file off the inside of the clamp part of it or the body. There's a variation in AK, just the way that they made it. Um, the bracket itself a little bit off, sometimes the body a little bit off. So it just depends on which model you have. Once you put it in, you can you know what to do right away. And this is for the X7, X7 classic version. So again, depends on what you have, you're gonna able to put in the way that you able to attach. Um, just to, like I said, it depends on what version you have. Now I'm gonna show really quick on how to, once you have assemble like this right here, this is the AK47 version. And once you assemble like this, um, you're gonna able to have to tighten these secure screw down so that way you can take it apart, put it, put it back together. So on the barrel, before you do anything, of course, check the barrel. It, the barrel actually hold everything into place. The barrel just twists right off and it just slides right off right here. You sometimes gonna be a little tight, that because there's an O-ring right there that's inside um, that little groove, then that allowed it to create a friction and prevent, uh, reduce any type of mood. So you can see that the back part, it's still in place. This part right here kind of weak a little bit, but once the barrel inside, it does not have that movement. So to take this assembly apart, a lot of people don't know that if you t loosen the screws right here, the front one, and then this other one here, this whole screw section here will allow, allow to slide this whole assembly forward right there, and which now you can take off your covers um, pretty easily there. So when you assemble them together, of course, you gotta able to um, loosen it out, and then that's pretty much it. And there's some cap right here, there's the rear cap. There is a little set screw right here. You can tighten it down if you want to, but that's a cap. And the front, that's a rear cap and this is a front cap. So to assemble together, um, reverse the process, of course. Right there. And of course the bottom, slide up here. Right there, and then slide down. That's pretty much it. That's all you really have to do. And then all you have to do is push it down nice and tight and put just screws. Right there, it just there's one each side, nice and tight. You use a two millimeter wrench, uh, Allen wrench, right there. Set it down, and of course you can see that's a little wiggle there. It's uh, it's that's normal. So once you have the barrel on, go down, tighten the place. So once aligned, that's it. And you can see that there's very little movement or no movement at all. There are some, but that's normal that because of the wood. There's nothing really hold the wood down other than the front cap and rear cap. Um, friction fit together. Unreal AK-47, pretty much the same. All right, guys, any question, comment, concern about the AK-47, how to put it back together, uh, how it is. Like I said, it, it is a little bit of work to install it, but once you have it in, it looks beautiful. All right, guys, any question, comment, concern about the AK-47, Visit our website, mcsus.com, and we can support you. Thanks for watching.